Hello everyone and welcome back to the Fat Hipster channel. Today I am going to be trying two new items from Night Castle. It's actually pretty funny, Night Castle. White Castle, actually. Um, but they're open 24-7, so they have cups that say Night Castle on them. This is just a Coke Zero. I was going to um, review a new drink they had, um, Peace Tea, which is uh, you know those long, kind of like Arizona cans of tea, but it's a different brand called Peace Tea. Um, apparently, White Castle was working with them, and they were serving it. But when I got there, they told me they didn't have it yet. So I changed my drink to a Coke Zero. But anyway, let's get on to the two things I did have we're going to review. The first thing is a new, technically it's a breakfast sandwich, but it's on their all-day menu. And these are their new French toast sliders. I have one with sausage and one with bacon, but that's the way you can get them. You can also just get a side of the French toast. I think you get two pieces, and they give you some Miss Butterworth. Here it is. It's a palm sized French toast sandwich. It has French toast, a fresh cracked egg, and this one has bacon and cheese on it. Let's go ahead and give it a taste. So, the only thing I'll tell you is that these are actually cinnamon French toasts, and just like having them in the bag near me, there's a very strong cinnamon aroma around me right now. It's actually quite good. They have um, decent bacon. The eggs at, at uh, White Castle, I've always liked. They do, they cook them hard, like the, the yolks are cooked all the way. But they're not too overcooked. I know for a fast food place, the eggs are going to have to be fully cooked. As for the French toast, you can see it has like a yellowish color to it. Mm. It's just slightly sweet. They do give you this uh, Miss Butterworth syrup for it. I'm not going to put syrup on mine. This seems like messy. We all know what Mr. Butterworth tastes like. It's high fructose corn syrup. Mm -hmm. Here's what I like about this. It's not dry at all. The bread is actually quite um, I wouldn't say moist, but it's tender. It has enough uh, moisture to it. And the egg and the cheese really give it a creaminess. And the bacon, extra good. Now here's the other thing. I will try some of the sausage ones though. But here's the second thing that I have that is brand new. I've never seen this before. But you know, at White Castle you can get onion rings. You can get chicken rings. But now you can get cheese rings. This is a cheese ring. It's supposed to have cheddar cheese in the middle. I'll break it. 
no kind of, there's no pull at all, but if you look inside, there's cheddar cheese. It's not like a solid cheese that would stretch. It's not like a cheese curd that would squeak. It's like, um, it tastes like they took like a nacho cheese or a cheese spread. And they filled a tube with that. So it tastes different than like a fried cheese curd or a mozzarella stick. It kind of tastes like have you ever had a jalapeno popper? Sometimes they come with cream cheese. But sometimes they come with a yellow cheese. And that's like what this yellow cheese is. It's like that pasty, creamy cheddar. I felt like running under the liquid. But you can't like bite into it or stretch it as if it was a solid. There's somewhere in the middle. It's like a cheese spread or a cheese paste, I would say. It is tasty. It has a good um, mild cheddar, maybe slightly sharpened. Uh, maybe there's a mix between mild and sharp cheddar. Um, but it's a uh, flavorful cheddar. I think it would go well with like a ranch dip um, if you're into that kind of thing. But uh, very good. Um, so the cheddar cheese rings. You can go with you can go to White Castle now and have like an all ring meal. You get chicken rings, onion rings, and now cheese rings. All all together in the same meal. And it'll be all ringed out. Uh, let's go ahead and taste the sausage French toast sandwich. There's gonna little bits of the egg fall out and stick to the side of that, but I like it's lacking in the egg. <laughs> Excuse me. Here we go. Sausage French toast. I like that. It's good. The um it's a breakfast sausage, so it has like that breakfast off its spice to it which um, I really think kind of plays well with the cinnamon that's in the French toast I think if I was to choose either one of these I would choose the bacon one I think the bacon mix the flavor of the bacon and the texture of the bacon mix better with like the cheese and the egg part um, but like if I was to get one with no egg or cheese I would get sausage Mm. Very tasty. So, besides not having the peace tea, which honestly I wasn't looking to buy, um, I was just looking at these two items. And when I was picking a drink, I saw this new item, peace tea. Well, while I'm trying all the new stuff, I'll try the peace tea. Maybe it's too new, so I don't have it yet. I know when the the red cream soda uh, that was delayed past the date that it was supposed to come out on. Um, so maybe it's the same thing. Maybe they're having issues with supply chains for their drinks, but they're not for the food. So if you are Looking to go get some White Castles. I do highly recommend these two items. 
French toast sliders, and the cheddar cheese rings. Both get two thumbs up from me, at Hipster. I hope that you give this video a thumbs up. Please subscribe to the channel for more, and I'll see you on the next video, whatever that may be. But until then, goodbye.